You know when you used to be brilliant at this game? <laughs> what? What? Where did he go? Oh my god. Ah, fighter of the night, man. Ah, champion of the sun. Ah, you're a master of karate and friendship for everyone. Damn That is no good when you're stealthing. <laughs> <laughs> Probably going to remember it next week. I don't know. But uh, not tonight. Not tonight. I need to get to bed. <coughs> Uh, Terry Val, welcome in. It's a, it's a, a fucking smoochy woochies. No, I'm done. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll be back with Return to Monkey Island next. Uh, yeah, it hits you afterwards. What is that? Oh! Oh! Yeah, no, nah, you're right. <laughs> Made it past the BBFC. Then make your way to the room in the back. Or Peggy. And wait. Cloud? You don't see anything, mine. <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. Oh, motherfucker! I'm a brick. You prick! Five finger death punch is like the very worst of WWE you entrance things. Multiplied by me. Static X. Now you're a mile! <laughs> We're all friends here except for Quijimo. He's a twat.
you doing? Oh, I think we're going to get immediate redeems here. Oh, look at my head. Sorry, I've got to scratch my feet. Haha. <laughs> it is Final Fantasy IV time. Uh, I better redeem those for uh, Bower. So uh, let's first of all do that. Uh... An LA night moment. Yeah! Let me talk to you! Yo, what a great ass. No, we won't. Nah. Bump that. Let's fucking go. Hello, good evening. Melissa Maxi Stacks, welcome in. Bauer, welcome in. Yeah. Big men. We're big men. We're big chests. And big muscles. Bumping meat. <laughs> it's not too long. That's why I'm here. <laughs> That's why I watch wrestling as a kid. You want your five star matches? You want your 30 minute classics? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Big meaty man slapping me. <laughs> right, okay, this is what we got coming up this week. So we have Dragon Age Inquisition tomorrow, Return to Drunky Island on Friday. Saturday, a bit of Final Fantasy IV, Sunday, Dragon Age Inquisition, and I think I might start Marvel's Spider-Man on Monday. Um, speaking of Spider-Man, this is what we've got coming up over the next couple of months. So, Spider-Man 1, Mars Morales and Spider-Man 2, Robocop Rogue City, we finished Doom Eternal last night, Black Flag, Final Fantasy IV and V, Breath of the Wild, finally, Desert Strike and Code Veronica X. I think uh, Code Veronica X is going to be a good one to do around Halloween. Saints Row, Return to Monkey Island, The new, uh, the Walking Dead, New Frontier, and uh, we are of course playing through the 500 greatest video games of all time, The Super Meat Boy, F-Zero, and Wipeout, all coming up very soon. Okay, right, let's crack on. So we've just gone to the underworld. We're nine hours in. And your birthday on the 15th, I believe you said, no. Right, let's, uh, is there anything to fight on here? That's a yes. Oh, shit. Good lineup. I fell asleep during Doom. I fell asleep too. Yeah, they are late streams this week. Uh, nothing that can be helped. Oh, there we go. There's a trophy. So we've got 50% of the best you're in now. Wonderful. Good to see you. Um, as I'm on late this week, it means the earliest I can get on is 10pm. But, uh, you know, VODs. And also it gives uh, people like Kram Snevitz and uh, Maxi Stacks a chance to come in. Um, actually, let's, uh, let's drop a shouty for Max... What have we got? Okay. How you died, baby. I was so scared. It's only because I needed to Whoa. Come and pull them. Yeah. yeah, you're gonna die, bitch. So, I'll be playing uh, for about four hours this evening. Come here, motherfucker. Call he said I think I speak for everyone when I say that Rust. Yes. Rust the video game is quite literally fucking cancer. <laughs> the melanoma style epic <laughs> plus one cancer. <laughs> melanoma is like the pussiest of all cancers, dude. What are you talking about? My hour is uh, two hours more. Oh, right, okay, so it's ten Rust past twelve. The so it's even later. What does this horse look like? Get on top, bitch. We'll try this horse. Why can't horses walk backwards? What is it with you and horses? Can't do nothing right. <laughs> Rust is okay, right, let's crack them. So we're going into the castle.
I'm Luca, my doll's disappeared. No, I haven't seen it. Okay, what we got going on here? But I'll watch repeat. No, fair go. Thank you very much for uh, getting so invested. Right then, welcome. You are... I am King Giot, ruler of the underworld. State your business. We've come in search of the Dark Crystals. Oh, I see. Same as the others, but from what I've witnessed, I gather you're not on their side. Please, tell me you still have the Dark Crystals. Unfortunately, they've stripped us of two. Now only two remain in our possession. We're a fraction too late. The castle's crystal's still safe. Our tanks fought them off. So those were your tanks we saw battling the airships on our way here. Airships, you call them. You overworlders create many incredible wonders. Our tanks have taken quite a beating. Can you help us with your airship? We'd love to, but she got busted up real good in the crossfire before. I need to repair her first. We'll do anything in our power to help you repair your airship. And she won't last in the heat of this magma. Anyway, I'll fix her best I can for now. But I need to fly back up to the surface and gather some mithril to armor her better. Okay, cool. Sid, just button up and relax. I'll be back before you know it. Be careful, Sid. Hehe, <laughs> no worries. I am a tough old man. Brilliant. Sid left the party. I feel you, Sid. When it gets too late, I too leave the party. Or drink till nine in the morning. I don't know, one or two. King Giot, where is the crystal? In the safest place and sit in the crystal. In the castle. Hidden behind my throne. Exclamation mark. Yang, what's wrong? Someone's spying on us. What? Perhaps it was your imagination. I wish it was so, but I definitely sense a presence. Open the door. Yes, sire. Uh-oh. It's locked. Yip ho ho. Dolls? Okay, I've no idea what's going on here. Open the door. Guess who? Yup, Calcabrenos. We're cute and we're scary. We love to kill. Let's take their heads. Yeah, a gift for Galbez. Yippee ho. What in the name of shit? Forgot to equip Rosa with her stuff. That's annoying. Do you know what? Do you know what? I have messed up. I've messed up real bad. If you don't defeat one of those things, you can't add them to the bestiary. So I need to kill one of each of those dolls. It's alright, I'll skip this as quick as I can. Open the door again. God damn it. Uh, if I didn't uh, if I didn't fight them then I wouldn't be able to add them to my vestry, which is really, really annoying.
Jeez. All right, there we go. big bullies, but now Galvez knows about this place. He's gonna get you, Sir Galvez. Oh shit. Our paths cross again. Colbez. I commend you for finding your way to the underworld. To reward your efforts, I shall tell you why I'm collecting the crystals. I require all eight in order to reactivate the Tower of Babel, which leads to the moon. Legends say a power beyond our comprehension can be found there. I need only one more crystal to turn my dream into reality. Excuse me. You have been a great aid to my quest. Now prepare for your final reward. Uh, I didn't do university. <clears throat> um, I decided that the academic studies weren't for me. Open your eyes and gaze upon true terror. Shadow, come forth. No, I mean, um, I work as a DJ and I also work as a contact centre team manager. <clears throat> <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, here we go. My shadow dragon destroyed by mist. You okay? You should be able to move now. That voice. This, this cannot be. You're an artist, you're drawing so good, and you're doing music too, that's so cool. Yeah, I haven't had the chance to do much artwork uh, lately. But I do have fun. Hooray, Rydia's back. Brilliant. We did it, we defeated Gobez. Rydia, you look so different. What happened to you? Leviathan told me to the land of summons. What's that? It's a world of monsters I can summon. We became friends during my stay. I learned a lot there. I can't use white magic anymore, but I've grown strong as a summoner. Time flows differently there, so I may have aged quite a bit. I say, you're a grown-up. 
Cecil, who's she? It's a girl we found in mist. She survived. Fortune favours us indeed. Rydia, we owe you our lives. Thank you. You don't have to thank me. The Queen of the London Summons said to me that the Great Force is secretly at work and we must confront it together. And so we shall. Excellent. I cannot perish. What? The crystal. Forgive me, Golbez has taken the crystal. One crystal left, we must protect it at all costs. Yes, where can we find it? In the sealed cave to the south southwest, where Golbez is no doubt heading. Do not worry, you can't enter without the key. I have a request. We'll do anything, it was our fault the crystal was stolen. I want you to retrieve the seven crystals from the Tower of Babel. That won't be easy. I presume it will be fortified. Do not worry, I have a plan. You'll sneak in and seize the crystals while our tanks distract them. The plan must be executed immediately before Golbez returns from the sealed cavern. What do you think? A large force might be waiting. It's a risk. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. As His Majesty says, now might be our only chance. All right, we'll go to the tower and reclaim the crystals. Right then, now it's time to do some looting. Looty looty. Well, now you've got Norfolk's maddest man. Mitchell Gear Solid, welcome in. Yeah. Okay, right. Let's go up here first. I'm not selling all that much. What are you selling? High potions. Yeah, let's get some of them. There we go, we get some of them. May as well. Thank you very much. Cherry Coke. Stairs was okay. Stay hydrated, King. Oh, I will. Thank you very much. So we go downstairs twice, and then there should be a door here. Okay, right, uh, there should be a chest here, okay, Dwarven Axe, lovely. Okay, now 
upstairs. There we go, there is uh, the halfway point in terms of treasure as well. That's half the treasure. And now we'll want to take the stairs down to the armory. Now before I even bother equipping shit, I'm going to see if I can optimize stuff. Now she'll be mostly using something else entirely, so... Good lance. Okay. How was my day? My day was okay. Yeah, it was at work, as I say. So I'm on the uh, I'm on the late shifts this week, but uh, I'm getting by. I'm doing all right. It wasn't the worst day I've had uh, ever. <clears throat> European post office here to flip Shut off. Up, bitch. Here to flip off makes you stacks. Okay. <clears throat> One development team office abandoned. Knock knock, who's there? Not me, because Final Fantasy is shit. Bye. Take it easy. How is the weather in England? Stupid questions, but I'm curious. No, not at all. Um, it is. It is alright. Um, it's not heavily raining yet, so that's uh, that's always a plus. You have permission from the king, then you may enter. Okay, where are we going? Crash! Bang! Voila! What a video! Ah, I'm just looking tonight anyway, mate. Yeah, I know. I thought you were, um... I thought you were doing, uh, film night or something like that. What a video! You can stop laughing or I'll take down your particulars. Right, okay. Empty chests. Go south and immediately... Right? Ah, oh, free cottages. Lovely. That is everything as far as loot. Mm. I've just started Misfits again. I'm on Series 3 at the moment. One of the best programs Channel 4 has put out. I never saw it. Never watched it. Okay, someone's, someone's had a load of these chests.
Oh, okay. Magic prop. And let's go up. Okay, we're on the world map now. We've made our way through the uh, thing. Goblin Captain. Nice, so now I've just got to get an armadillo and magma toys again. This level design reminds me of a phone uh, Java game named Diamond Rush. Oh, I know Diamond Rush. All good Java games. Oh, we just hit for 666. Number of the beast. Die, monster. You don't belong in this world. We should take out all the monsters. Okay, so... I hate these things. I could do with really swapping places, I think. There we go, that's better. So now she'll take less damage. Uh, where am I going? Right, so we're going to the Tower of Babel. Not to be confused with the Tower of Babel in Doom, of course. We won't be fighting any cyber demons. More monsters. Favourite Soundgarden song? Oh, man. They are my favourite band of all time. Uh, my favourite Soundgarden song is... God, I don't know. It changes so often. But um, I do like... The, the Day I Tried to Live, really, really good song. Um, I'm quite a fan of Slaves and Bulldozers and also Searching With My Good Eye Closed. Overfloater as well is a really good one. Yeah, Black Hole Sun is, uh, is great as well. Big fan. Oh god. Okay. Tower of Babel, Underworld then. I like rock too, especially progressive. Progressive rock's sweet. I do like progressive rock. Right, so we have got some... Who's your favourite progressive band? Okay, so we've got to find the mystery egg. Uh, white moose. Evil doll, apparently. Medusa. Fiery Knight and a Chimera. Evening, I've got two tabs open, one for Final Fantasy V and you on Final Fantasy IV. Welcome in, good to see you. My favourite progressive band is Gentle Giant. Class. Absolutely class. Um, I've, uh, I've always been partial mostly to uh, King Crimson. Uh, okay. There's Evil Dalgon. Okay, we should gain a few levels in here. Uh, there's an emergency exit. Okay, 
this should be the one south of here. King Crimson, you have taste, Mr. Harris. Yeah, I'm I am a fan of King Crimson. Love King Crimson. Um, Lark's uh, Lark's uh, in aspect is fucking fantastic. Okay, so we're going to go east here and should be able to get through there to get a chest. Looks like all we're going to find here is either those, so that's uh, it's just lovely. There's a uh, cane going to level up there. And a rune staff collected, lovely. How do I get in there? Okay, we're going from the bottom. Lovely. I do like uh, Hawkwind as well. How goes trophy, uh, trophy hunting tonight? Uh, yes, I did finish Doom Eternal last night, um, and that was a that was a challenge. But um, yeah, and then from there I played a bit of Dragon Age Inquisition. Uh, so we're at the last two story missions apparently of Dragon Age Inquisition. So quite excited to see where we go with that. I think we're getting to the end of it. We can move forward with the 500 Greatest Games or carry on with them. Okay, excellent. Rose is starting to level up. Or continuing to level up, I should say. Okay, so we're going through the north door here. So the trophy hunting tonight, we've already uh, worked out we're halfway through the best year uh, officially, and uh, I've got half the treasure chests available in the game. So yeah, we're making real progress. Oh, Melissa gifting five tier one subs to the community. Thank you very much. Gifted a total of 17. Um, that is very much appreciated. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Hey, Spaceman, welcome in. Happy Halloween season to you all. Happy Halloween season to you too, Space. Are you doing any uh, halloween -y games this year? I haven't decided which I'm doing just yet, but there's a couple that I've been looking at. Oh, ween season. What is ween season? Like the band ween? <laughs> like Halloween but sexier. Like Halloween but sexier. Good times. You guys reminded me about nothing at all talking about uh, Gentle Giant. Ah, oh, man. I do like a sexier Halloween. Right, so we got an ice sword, which is uh, wonderful. Okay. Do -do, do -do. So we've beaten Chimera. Uh, I should probably equip the Ice Spren now, I've got that. Right. Ooh. 
Oop, fiery hind and fiery knight. Three more enemies to collect. I think I might have to add some gentle giant onto my Spotify playlist for uh, my journeys to work. Lovely stuff. Iceland. So I assume that we're going to fight something icy. Not that I needed that. Okay. So we're going through the northernmost door. Oh, jeez. I want a big fat orange cat to heal my sadness with its fluffy fur. Fluffy fur. Oh, well, I needn't have done that. There we go, an early incarnation of Shiva. They're right there for you. Oh, no, I want to go up to the mid... Do I want to go up to the mid-door? It said northernmost, so I'm guessing just here. Okay, Underworld 3. I do like cats, I don't know where mine all are this evening. Although one of them brought a mouse in last night, because that's what they fucking do. Uh, cat claw, I wonder what that will do. Oh, okay, now we're about to uh, cause some serious damage. Lovely, things you love to see. Getting a lot of these fiery hounds and fiery knights. I'm wondering when we're going to come across a Medusa, Mystery Egg, and White Noose. Kill a bow, eh? Come on. Let's go. 
East here. Ah, White Moose. Kind of games, especially dungeon crawlers, need uh, need a lot of patience because they always have long play times. Atlas's earlier Persona games and dungeon crawlers, they're like 100 hours, 100 plus. I've uh, I've only ever played Persona 5, but I do intend to revisit earlier in the series as soon as we've worked through the mainline series of Final Fantasy. Definitely. Uh, but I, I adore these games. Okay, we just need a mystery egg and a Medusa. I really get bored uh, by repeat battles, so I really appreciate people who can finish this kind of game. It's a patient skill for real. Yeah, definitely. I mean, the pixel masters of this are absolutely brilliant because they have the auto battle features, so you don't have to completely sit there and bash controls like you used to have to do. Plus, it's a, it's a lovely experience, especially... I mean, it makes those where you have a 1, one in 64 encounter rate, like on Final Fantasy 1, uh, a lot easier. Definitely. Okay, Underworld Crawler. Choose a cottage. It's really nice that they can build a uh, build a fucking cottage. May as well save it. We've made some progress since then. Okay. So we're going north and across a bridge as such. The sleeping jingle. It's so cute. The sleeping jingle's great. Ding 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 ding. Always has some memorable ones, Final Fantasy. The Chimera and the Fire. Ooh, fiery Night. I mean, we're absolutely smashing through these enemies, so uh, I haven't yet come across the difficulty spike, which uh, I noticeably came across my very first time playing through Final Fantasy IV. I'm not sure how long that'll last. I mean, the monsters in the box are usually quite difficult. Oh, it's a Naga. Shield, lovely. Oh,
just... That didn't, though. Okay. Right, well, that ghost looks like me. <laughs> oh no, she's going to cast fire and heal it. Oof. Oh! have allergies um, I do occasionally um, get stressed uh, and uh, yeah cat hair allergy so <laughs> can be bad sometimes being completely honest uh, more so um, when I'm irritable and lack of sleep. It's been noticeably worse as of late. I know it carries over. But I'll freely address it, you know. Like, I'll rub my eyes a bit as well. Which you may have noticed. I, I'm sure it's very noticeable, but it's uh, it's one of them. Okay, right. south and immediately north to get a chest okay so we're going to want to go up here there we go sometimes I don't even realise I'm doing it I'm also allergic like, sort of, to peanuts. I've got a mild peanut allergy. Um, but I haven't been eating peanuts because that would be silly. Uh, okay, so we've got the Ocean Wind, bottom area, and then we need to get the chest from here. Why aren't we coming across the Medusa and the Mystery? Did you ever co op game stream? Really? No, 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 not, no, of course not. Of course you're not speaking too much. Um, I've never co-op game streamed. Um, I, I'm one of those who doesn't play well with others, and that's not to say that uh, I don't enjoy playing with company or anything like that. Um, I'm one of those who uh, I, I do prefer a good single-player game. But no, please don't worry about talking too much. I'd much rather you say something uh, so I feel like I'm speaking to someone rather than no one at all. Okay, high potion. Go north and through the door. Oh, I need to stop that fire spell because it just keeps healing everyone. I must remember that next time. Okay, through the north door. So we're now in the underworld, western door. Let's go through here. Now we're in underworld 7F. So we need to go east for the save point. Oh, it looks like security eyes just uh, appearing and appearing now. I mean, I could farm these, but yeah. Uh, I don't like verbalite games, I kind of like no competition. Uh, 
more uh, oh like Dragons and Dungeons Online or Saints Row, maybe Stardew Valley. So you like your co-op games, okay? I mean, soon I intend to drop into the world of Final Fantasy XI for the first ever time. So uh, I know it's a bit outdated, but you can still uh, access the servers uh, if you don't go via Steam and if you go via uh, the Square Enix platform. So I'm going to have a look into doing that because I do want to play the mainline series. I'm a bit of a completionist. Oh, I've got stream of friends, yeah, but uh, I I don't tend to co-op stream. I've just ne never done it. I've never fancied it. But that's just me. There we go, there's a Medusa. So we've got a Medusa now, we just need a mystery egg. Right, I need to get a mystery egg. Wherever I get that. I might have to keep walking around until one turns up. Right, let me just have a look into mystery eggs. Mystery egg, Final Fantasy IV. Just bear with me. Okay. So we just need to keep walking around this floor until we fight a mystery egg. I like, uh, like Neverwinter. It's uh, it's so nice, but sadly I'll lack sometimes English grammar because I'm not a native. I mean, you do all right. I completely understand what you're saying. So, I don't see why someone wouldn't be able to understand what you're saying, because I mean, I understand you absolutely fine. I learned a little bit of English myself with playing games. Oh right, okay, so uh, you pretty much learned a lot from what you know from playing games. Okay, well, that's a cool way to learn. God damn it. Can I have a sniff? Yeah. Chicken with bugs, welcome in. 
What is a mystery egg encounter rate? Getting your lonely, you can always go back ah, to tune, tune. How was your life when I was 20? Uh, when I was 20, I don't remember all that much. <laughs> no, it was alright. I mean, I worked a bar job. Um, so I was a barman. Um, I did start college, but it just wasn't for me. And then I worked in uh, retail. So... I was also very drunk at 20, definitely, like all the time. I just partied a lot. I mean, that was almost 20 years ago. Pretty much almost exactly 20 years ago. Paris is fun to party with. Yes. I, I do like to party. It has been known. Uh, but even more so then. Um, we've got like so many clubs in town that were doing rock music at that point. Uh, and that's that was sort of my jam a lot of the time. So I would... Um, I would go out a lot. We're very responsible adults and always go to bed at very reasonable times. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, I need a mystery egg. Where am I gonna find this? I'm gonna be 20 in a close time. Uh, and I feel like nothing, that's why I asked. Do you know what, like, I, I get that. Like, uh, I mean, nothing really changed. You talk about these milestone birthdays and about how things are going to be really, really different, but uh, but no. European is your friend that whole time. Well, no, that's friendship. Yeah, um, he is uh, an in real life friend. I've known him for. Uh, Quite, quite a long time now. I couldn't tell you how many years. Now, does it mean this floor with the save room? I don't seem to be finding them here. I've known Harris longer, I think, but not IRL. Yeah, well, um, we, we've been on forums for... Uh, for ages, like, I mean, I was on that forum. God. Probably, Jesus Christ, probably about 24, 25 years ago. Yeah, I think I was 15, maybe before then. I don't, I couldn't tell you. 99, yeah. That's why European gets so mad, because I didn't invite him, that's fair. <laughs> Yeah, but it's funny.
Sorry about that. You always want pizza, sir. I'm good at eating pizza. Maxi stacks. Arguing with European post office. These are the things that I live for. Right, so it says they're on the floor with the save room. I've really got to find this fucking mystery egg. I'm good at crying. Want a challenge? <laughs> okay, I want to know where exactly I find these mystery eggs. Apparently on the run the same floor as the save room, so is it the fact that I'm going to have to go back to the save room on the other floor? Do you cry to Fallout Boy records? No, but Fallout 3 is cryable. I'd rather that. I had Fallout 3, got bored of it, never even made it out of the vault. You've been known as someone to, uh, who gives things a chance, and not you? Well, what's this here? The door is locked. Okay, brilliant. Yeah, it was a very bad game. Shame. New Vegas is very good. I heard New Vegas was very, very good, actually. Uh, but I've never played a Fallout game. I should probably remedy that. I'm terrible for it. I get bored very quick. You didn't get too far in Skyrim, either, did you? Though, admittedly, my first time playing Skyrim, I didn't get very far. I didn't get it at the time, I don't think. So I might get on well with the new Fallouts, or the latest Fallouts. I've got to find this mystery egg. Don't tell me I'm going to be running around for ages looking for something with a very low encounter rate. 18 hours into Skyrim before I got rid of it. Egg. Yeah, where is this mystery egg? I need an egg. I need to find the egg. Sorry about this. Right, give me one sec. Okay. Right, apparently we can find mystery eggs elsewhere.
This is really, really annoying. I'm scouring these floors. I think I'll do 10 fights on each. Matrix Path and Neo. I wouldn't mind uh, revisiting that. Uh, PGS games like Skyrim and Fallout and Acquired Taste. Inappropriate pizza mods. I mean, I did enjoy Skyrim to be fair on my second run through. On my PS4 run through. I mean, I liked it enough to go and play it. I think I kind of just forced myself to play it. Oblivion way better. Platinum The Sims. Can you Platinum The Sims? It's best played with mods on PC. Yeah, because I've heard there's a mod where you can just put monocles on all the mud crabs. Or there's a heart attack uh, mod, which uh, at random points of the game will say that you've got a heart attack and die. Platinum Candy Crush. Can you Platinum Candy Crush? Is that a PS4 game? Can you play Candy Crush on PS4 with trophies? Guys, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to go for a quick cigarette. I'll leave these guys fighting because it looks like the kind of battle that's going to take a while. BRB. No American says bean for bean. What do you say? Beans. I'm going to have some beans. Some baked beans. Oh, COVID. <coughs> Get back. I will beat COVID. <laughs> Imagine cream pie in your nan on FIFA. Oh my god, that sounds wrong. Um, oh! Oh, oh! Oh! Jackpot! Yes, lad! It's like Japanese status quo, isn't it? Anyway. Start forest fire. I would love to start forest fire. There's nothing I'd like more. It's the only way I can come. <laughs> Did it? What's that guy doing? Are you okay? Boo 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 boo. Is he? Is he all right? Fuck off. Uh, shall I line it up? Asshole. You can, or you can get the. You can. You can get the me 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 Oh, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Ah! Ah! No thanks. Check. Get down with bed. That's more like. Mm. 
7-2 off. That's an all-in hand if I ever saw it. What do I do here? be the last side you look at, wouldn't it? Aha! There we go. There it is. Five more to go. Okay. I love potatoes. Who doesn't? Who doesn't love a good potato? Now this should be a save room, I think. Okay, so we're going to carry on looking. Potatoes are the most versatile food. Um, roasted potatoes and chips are probably my favourite. If anyone told you that, hey, Harris doesn't like chips, then they would be wrong. Little Bill Hicks bit for you there. Right, I am going to create a second save just in case we do go too far without the, uh, without the egg that we've been searching for. I have 2,000 Harris points. Brilliant. Keep them for community challenges. And there's the egg. Fantastic. We can move on. And then two show up at once. Classic Final Fantasy. Classic Final Fantasy, you spend ages looking for something, can't find it, go for a break, come back and then two come along. You're my Final Fantasy. Terry Ball, welcome in. Good to see you. Can I get a shout out for Terry, please? Ah. And a shout out Unto for Terry. the horizon. Here we my hair go, Stepchat. My name is Beardageddon. And I it want was. you to subscribe and give me thousands of viewers. I deserve thousands of viewers, uh, because my name is Beard Gavin. How do you know which way's straight and which way's not? Ginger hair, beautiful. See, I'm, uh... I think it's just a light. Mine is sort of a uh, muddy brown. What is this? Is this little nightmares or something? I've not played that yet. Oh, and here's Cram Snevis, the wonderful Cram Snevis. Shout, Cram! I like your muddy brown pass. Ah, ah, just no. <laughs> <laughs> that is how you start the game. 
Oh my god. This is... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to stop her. <laughs> well, right out the gate. That's how to get burned. How to get burned. How to get burned. Okay, now what? Okay, so how many chests are there in here? We've got all 16. Oh, I think we're right near the boss. Baldur's Gate 3. Their romance. I've not played Baldur's Gate 3 just yet. I will uh, eventually get around to it. Yeah, dude, I finished and reviewed it. My review of it's in the Discord. Oh my days. Tuna Himatoma coming in here with a Prime subscription. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, I beat The Evil Within 2. I really, really enjoyed it. I thought it was fantastic. Okay. Right. I'm going to quick save here because I'm certain there's a boss. Uh, Baldur's Gate 3 is the best CRPG ever made. It took out Fallout 2 from my power rankings. Easy game of the year. So a lot of people are going on. Oh, what we got here? I'm a hauling brawler. Halfling brawler, sorry. Better than Dragon Age uh, Origins. Yes. Hmm. I started a new run with a buddy last night. Oh, okay. Especially if you like turn-based combat. Oh, I do like, uh, I do like uh, turn-based combat. Combat, combat, combat. Thank you very much for the sub tuner. It's appreciated. Uh, have a safe trip, Master Rubicante. Do not worry about me. Eblan has already been decimated, along with its ninjas. Take care of things until I return. Did he travel or did he explode? It, are you okay? Hehe, <laughs> Golbez and Rubicante are gone. I'm in charge now. What's with him? I'm into sexy heat combat quick and harsh. <laughs> as far as presentation, they're similar to Dragon Age, but looks better, and decisions and dice roll outcomes have way more weight. Shh, who's there? Cecil, how did you get up here? Caught you at a bad time, eh? What a pity Rubicante isn't around to protect you. How dare you disrespect me, fool? I may not be an elemental lord, but I, Dr. Lugi... Is it Lugi or Luje? And the brains of Golbez's operation. On my honour, I'll protect this tower. That's a laugh. I've heard enough out of you. My greatest creation will shoot you up soon enough. Okay. What is this boss music, man? What is going on in the underworld? Yow, you big oaf. Over there, beat them up, not me. Grr, show no mercy. Mr. Harris, choose Coca-Cola or iced tea? Coca-Cola, probably. I do like iced tea, though. Could be preference, though, because as far as RPGs are concerned, I'll take turn-based every time. Then you come to the right place. I mean, that was hardly worth it. How dare you? I'll show you why I'm feared. Another boss fight. No more games. What, even Final Fantasy 4? 
No, you dick. He's putting everyone to sleep, the little cunt. Oh. Oh! Turn base makes me sleepy sleepy. Ice tea is refreshing. Where is spam? It doesn't let you rename the characters in uh, this Final Fantasy. Oh lord! What? Yeah, it doesn't let you do it on uh, Final Fantasy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, we got his key. Brilliant. You're too late. The Tower of Babel connects all the underworld and the overworld, and Rubicante has already taken all the crystals to the surface. The dwarves will be annihilated with my cannons. Victory is mine. Wahahaha. Oh, and he just explodes. Okay. The doors are in danger. We have to stop the cannons. What are we waiting for? Let's go. Okay. Now where do we go? Got anyone with the Zuna? No, you'll do. Let's use up the rest of my potions. I've got high potions now, so there's no need. That's easy. It's kind of a warp system, but it doesn't look like we can use it. Oh, there's nothing that we can do here, okay. White Moose! God, Bio does massive damage in this one. That's acid! I miss, I misread it as easy. Uh, but yeah, going back onto the Evil Within 2, I mean, it's it's quite clear that there were a lot of uh, borrowed ideas, as happens in a lot of games. Um, but I felt that the borrowed ideas didn't detract. I think they added something to the game. I really enjoyed the story, um, and I think whilst it wasn't quite as scary as the first Evil Within, there was definitely some real sinister moments. Uh, so yeah, 8 out of 10. Okay, so we've got to go back to floor fun. It's the most unique action-oriented survival, survival horror out there, I think. Yeah, I definitely feel it was good. Oof. And yes, yeah, I would agree that it's underrated. Definitely. I enjoyed my time with it. Dollar shaped snake. It certainly was. Which is a shame because I would have loved to see an Evil Within 3. Well it's been hotly tipped off. Yeah, a Evil Within 3, what they what they originally intended to be, ended up being Ghostwire Tokyo. Um, but I think in the latest uh, what's that hi-fi game, the one there, there's a lot of hints to the um, to the Evil Within 3. So, I think we'll see it. And they left it on a bit of a cliffhanger, so...
you know, post credits. Hi-Fi Rush, that's the one. Thank you, Tate. Uh, I never played Ghostwire Tokyo, so I wouldn't make an assumption before actually getting a hands-on with it. The old uh, Solid Snake there. If they go first person with the Evil Within 3, I'm going to break a chair. I don't think they will. Hi-Fi Rush is really good. I need to get around to uh, looking at it. I mean, isn't it very similar to Jet Set Radio, or am I thinking of another game here? I did see someone on here playing it. Yeah, they look the same. Am I going to play the new Assassin's Creed that comes out today? Eventually. I'm on a series run though, so it might be a little while before I bother picking that up. Um, although my next one is Assassin's Creed Black Flag. This is what I've got coming up, by the way, fairly shortly. So I'm going to be doing the Spider-Man trilogy, Robocop Rogue City, Breath of the Wild. I've been threatening Breath of the Wild for too long. I need to pick that up. Uh, Black Flag is coming. Um, Final Fantasy 4 and 5, Desert Strike, Code Veronica Rex, Saint Sorry, Return to Monkey Island, Walking Dead New Frontier. Yeah, that's my second favourite Assassin's Creed is Black Flag. Uh, and then as part of the 500 greatest video games of all time is all of that bottom row. So we got Super Meat Boy, Dragon Age Inquisition, F-Zero, and OG Original Wipeout. So, there we go. The door is locked. The door has been unlocked. Okay. Haha, <laughs> killing dwarves is fun. You cowards. You, how did you get in here? Kill them. Settle down, beaver. Well, congratulations on killing me, you dwarf Captain Fox. Okay. Uh, destroy the controls. Wait, I thought they were dead. Nothing can stop the cannons now. Sorry, I had to mute the microphone so far though. Damn it! Yang, what are you doing? Leave this to me. Go, get out of here. No, it's going to explode. Go now. Yang. Cecil, everyone, thank you for the memories. Open the door. Yang, please don't do this. There must be another way. I guess there isn't. Tell my wife I will always be with her. Yang, farewell. Ooh, Harris, look up the Legend of Beavis on YouTube. Thank me later. I've seen it. You shared it with me before. It's where someone said... Or, or it was... Um, goat who shared it with me but uh, someone someone um, it's where they put like Beavis uh, in the Legend of uh, Legend of Zelda cartoons the nighty ones I love how you make regular planned schedules for games and not just random streaming oh you think you mentioned it before yeah I did enjoy it though it was really well put together So I've just lost my most powerful party member, so that's that's not great. Now I'd use an emergency exit, but I may as well uh, level my guys up on the way out, because uh, level 70 is uh, where you've got to get all your party members to in order to get a trophy, so may as well work towards that. I agree. I'm jealous of Harris's discipline to see us stick to a schedule. Yeah, I mean, despite the fact that sometimes I'm a bit late on, um, I do try and stick to a schedule and pick what I'm playing in advance, uh, especially with the Discord choice. I absolutely love the fact that I've got people who go into the Discord and vote for a game, and then we, we decide what's going to be played. Um, but I appreciate it.
Although, with that said, Breath of the Wild has been on this month's uh, image for around about uh, almost six months, and I've still not played it. But some games say they take a little bit longer than anticipated. Also, I'm really pleased with uh, how the exports to YouTube are looking now. I've given them pretty much all thumbnails and stuff. They all look really, really cool. Uh, if you don't know what the hell I'm talking about, just bear with me. They all look really, really fucking neat. Um, I'm a little bit anal about stuff like that, so let's search Nukebox Harris. Oh, come on, it's not even going to bring me up. Ah, here I am. Right, so what I've done is I've gone over my playlists. So we got like old Twitch streams. Why not both? But if you look over here, then I've got like all um, thumbnails and stuff on there now, and I export them as is. So any of the previous streams, if you want to go and have a look at some of the games that I played, you can find uh, on here. So. I've spent a bit of time doing this, but they all look super cool. Anyway, you get the general idea. I hope we get Metal Gear Revengeance for October. I vote for my suggestion. Uh, I commented one, don't remember which one. Yeah, I did, um, I did see. Yeah, it's taken me a while, but now I've gotten into a routine. I've gone through everything done through 2022 to um, this year's streams and it just looks a lot better and they're getting some views especially Gollum people seem obsessed with Gollum and I think it's purely because of how bad that game actually is What level am I at? Okay, I'm just touching level 40, so we're making great progress. Final Fantasy 4, I've no idea why, but it seems to be on a lot of people's favourite Final Fantasy ever list. I mean, I, I do like it, and it's the first time there was um, a story with this much detail, and it was on SNES. Uh, released in the US as, uh, of course, uh, Final Fantasy 2. Oh dear me. We respect disciplined Mr. Huis. Solid. I will take back Baldur's Gate 3 for Game of the Year. It is Gollum. That game, man, I... It still amazes me. I wonder if they got a new patch, patch out for it just yet. Or is they spelled it Pack, P-A-C-T-H. Okay, we're on the first floor. <laughs> I really do need to do some animated emotes. Uh oh. You never cease to amuse me. Golbez, when the cat is away, the mice will play. But the game ends now. Oh 
вообще. And sub badges. Yeah, I could do some of this. What's my favourite part of streaming? Honestly, um, I enjoy I enjoy speaking to people, which is kind of cool. I enjoy uh, being able to speak with a bunch of mates when they pop in, um, and uh, I enjoy uh, that I'm able to save my vods and export them to YouTube for watching later on if I get the inclination. Can you even do animated sub badges? I don't I don't know. He he was a hero till the very end, so he lost another good man. Sob sob. And who's she? This is Rydia. She's a summoner from Mist. Damn, they're still on me. Can we lose them? I don't know. The Red Wings fleet seems to have been upgraded. Though it looks like they got fucking... Jeff Hardy at the wheel. They're catching up. Come on, baby, you can do it. The engine's not going to last. Cecil, take over. Sid, where are you going? Once the Enterprise flies out here to the service, I'm going to seal the entrance with this bomb. Wait! Oh yeah, head on back to Baron afterwards and get in touch with my men. Cecil, take good care of Rosa. Treat her well. Stop, there has to be another way. Sid, please don't. Hey, that's Uncle Sid to you. Remember, head for Baron immediately. Now this is what I call going out with a bang. Ha ha ha. Oh. Sid, why? Everyone chooses death too hastily. Let's head to Baron. Volcano! Wait, I can go to the inn, can I? It's about to go and waste a bunch of money. Poor old Sid. Uh, is that second or third of his name? There is a... S Yes, there's a Sid in Final Fantasy 2 and 3. The only Final Fantasy I think that there isn't a Sid in is the original. Fun fact! And this is the second one with summons in. Okay. It's a problem no one understands If there's two things he loves, it's fighting and Fight round the world Making movies, making music and fighting round the world Russell Crowe Okay, so they're fixing the airship now I do love the fighting man in the world, so...
<laughs> it's done. Now we've done a little dance, we can hoist and carry the hovercraft. Wonderful. Just fly the Enterprise right over the hovercraft and press confirm to pick it up and drop it down. And you can pretty much go everywhere now. Even the cave of Iblan that leads to the Tower of Babel. Simply lower the hovercraft over the shallows to board it. Okay, I will do that. There's something I must tell you both, it's about Sid. He's impossible, yes we know, with all that crazy energy I can't imagine he'll ever check out. Oh, and there's Yumi raiding with a party of 15! Welcome in! Welcome! Gaps, who dis? Distant Fantasy, welcome in! Oh, Yumi, how you doing? Someone shout out Yumi for me, please. Hello! What have you been streaming? Have you had fun? We're playing Final Fantasy IV this evening. I doubt anyone could put him out of commission. What up? I'm okay and you? Yeah, I'm really good. Oh, you were playing Final Fantasy V? Okay, that is that is the one in the first ten that I've not played. So uh, I am looking forward to um, that next. But uh, let's let's get a shout out. Let's cut this music so we can see hear the clip. Yeah. Oh, bit of flute. Do you maze from Brazil? Do you maze from Brazil? É nós, pô! What what was just said? No, but I hope your stream was good. Thank you very much for choosing me to raid in too. I doubt anyone could put him out of commission. We must return to work, but good luck to you all. Okay, so now we can pick up the hovercraft with the airship, which is lovely. Now I've just got to remember where I put it. Oh, I can see a blue thing on the map. So I am trying a 100% run, so uh, I'm using... Using a... Not a walkthrough uh, road map, but just when I don't get all the chests and I don't get all the best re-entries, and if there's anything missable, then I'm... Uh, I'm using that. He was saying, it's us, in Brazilian dialect. Let's get another one. Should we get another one, Yumi? No, but how far did you get in Final Fantasy V? Did you just start playing it this evening? Let's see, what else have we got? Oh, a bit of uh, Resident Evil 5. With Sheva, the most useful idiot. <laughs> well, she did have a head. Space span his wheel. He's got to play Gollum. How do I do yes. this then? How, how, <laughs> how can you join? Brilliant. Yep. Sheva. Oh dear, Sheva. No, people say I'm somewhat past middle point. Yes. <laughs> Asshole. What is happening here? Is this is, is this person? golf? It looks like somewhat golf. And you've been playing Jump King. Oh man, I never want to play Jump King again. I am no good at Jump King. Okay, so where are we going? Um, let's go. If someone ever says Sheva is really useful, they've never really played Resident Evil 5. Golf with your weird friends. I'm really, uh, really bad at it. Okay. So we're going to go onto the bottom south continent, I believe, which is where Castle Iblan was. But um, there's supposed to be a cave, which he mentioned. So we've been here before. Time for some sleepies. Hey, no problem. Thank you very much for the raid. I appreciate it, Yumi. Damn Sheva. Um, sleep well. Thank you very much for the raid. I really do appreciate it. Thank you for sharing your community with myself. I'm on the late shift, so uh, I'll be up until around about 2 a.m. So if you haven't had your fill of Final Fantasy, then we'll be doing some today or this evening until around about 2 a.m. UK.
Uh, this is open to the chat. What is the best Final Fantasy? And who is excited for Final Fantasy Rebirth? And if you don't like Final Fantasy, why don't you like Final Fantasy? Sort your life out. And I will lead. My favourite is... It's a tie, actually, between OG6 and OG7. Rebirth can't come any sooner. Tomb Raider remasters will carry me over on February the 14th until the release of Rebirth. You're going to polish them all off in uh, in 15 days, eh? I do want to get the Tomb Tomb Raider remasters. I'm really very excited to play those. I hope they don't do trophies for um, for for a no death run because I know for a fact I haven't played Tomb Raider since probably secondary school properly, unless you um, count the very very good reboots. I was very proud of the days that I completed uh, Tomb Raider two and Tomb Raider one there back in the day. I actually need to keep an eye on them rather than auto battle, don't I? Oh dear. Oh, that's why he's undead. He's using the blood lance. Let's change that to the ice lance. That was a stupid move. Let's attack the undead, so it also means that it hurts him to attack them. Oh no, I don't want to use my elixirs yet. They will remain in my inventory until... and after the end of the game, because I save them and save them and save them and never use them. Anyone else do that? Oh, I'll save that until I actually need it, and then you never use it. Uh, Tomb Raider 2, out of all five of them, is the hardest. So many enemies and little ammo. That's next for my no load and no, uh, no meds. And I only managed to get five levels in. It's better than I would do. Who goes there? Oh, humans. Well, he sounds very disappointed. Okay, let's get some uh, purchases. The only real challenge uh, challenges I set myself on a game, other than 100%, uh, was when I was doing OG Resident Evil speedruns. And I managed to get my time down to around about um, an hour and 15 in the original Resident Evil, which was uh, very much a challenge. Welcome, what can I do for you? Well, that's a damn good question. I'm going to take that because I have a feeling I might need to use it. I'm going to take that too because I feel I may need to use it. What have we got in terms of... Definitely take one of them.
Okay, head west and into the uh, into the room. So I'm just uh, referring to the guide to see where the hidden items are. I have completed this before. I noticed you were doing OG Resident Evil 1. I love the games, but I don't think I'm good enough for speedruns. Uh, I didn't think I was good enough for speedruns, but uh, ho hum, I did them. Okay, so that is all the hidden items here. And then we're going back into the Iblen Cave. Oh, there's a uh, 20, 20 chests. Oh dear me. The prince went on alone. Okay, well I'm gonna go down here. Get that chest. Uh, can we suggest two games in a month? No, you can only suggest one game uh, per month. Because uh, then everyone gets to say so. But you can vote for two. You can vote two. So you put two votes on, and then we tally those up at the end of the month. And then that forms a Discord choice. If any, Code Veronica X or uh, OG Resident Evil 3, I'd try. No, I just think it's a great way for the community to vote on what they want to see. As a whole. Okay, then November for Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. I'll definitely put that in there. I'll let you know when the um, when you can put put forward uh, another game because I believe you you put forward Revengeance, didn't you? So people can vote on that uh, any time from the 16th onwards. I think you'd end up with a major backlog of games. Otherwise, yeah. That's precisely it. Please stop the prince. Okay. Okay, there's a bomb core. Okay. Ah, brilliant. There's another shuriken. Those shurikens, if they're anything like Final Fantasy 3, are just ridiculously strong, so they're worth keeping until late game. But I don't know if they repurpose the shurikens in Final Fantasy 4, so I haven't really got any memory of ever using shurikens. Unless a ninja has a um, throw option. But I suppose we'll find out. The prince went after Rubicante. Yeah. I get like that when I'm up late after a while. I like a nice little scratch. When the prince gets worked up like that, no one can stop him.
Scratch, scratch out. Scratch, scratch out. Complete with the Daniel Battersby emote. Okay, what have we got next? So, down these stairs, just give me a head of quick scratch as well. Spider Silk. Silver Hourglass. Phoenix Down, Phoenix Down. Now, I think... How many more chests have we got? Three to go. Okay. Have we fought a stone golem yet? I don't think I have. Soldier. Oh, I get it. It's a cross between Skull and Soldier. Brilliant. Or Steel Golem. I don't know. Oh, we're learning Blizzaga. All these magic spells which I have yet to use. Okay, what have we got here? Um, save room. Things you love to see. Just give me one second. Yep, Steel Golem is a monster in the box encounter. Right then. Okay, well that's Emden. And I've got a blood sword which I'm not going to equip because there's still undead enemies around here which would just ruin Christmas. Okay. And a mystery egg. Brilliant. Oh, a lamia. Okay. Thanks for coming. <laughs> Rubicante, at last we meet. Am I supposed to know who you are? I am Edge, Prince of Eblin. Eblin? Don't believe I've heard that name before. It doesn't matter, because you're about to meet your demise. Young man, behave yourself. Poor technique. This is how it's done. So he is one of the four fiends. I believe he's a fiend of fire. Oh, dear. Ah! I must say, I'm quite impressed. Continue training. I look forward to our next meeting. Oh, I remember him being uh, being actually quite respectable to your characters. Come back. Are you alright? I can't believe I lost. Who are you? We're after Rubicante, same as you. Stay out of this, he's mine. Well, you obviously don't know who you're dealing with. He's one of the four elemental lords. You saw how easily he overpowered you just now. Ha, you take me for some craven prince. I'm the rightful heir to the throne of Eblin. A kingdom long famed for its ninjutsu. Leave. I can take care of myself. Stop it. Teller, Yang, Sid, they're all gone. Please, no more. Sub. Hey. Ridia. Sob, sob. 
Rubicante is the strongest of the four lords. The odds might be against us, but somehow we must recover the crystals. Alright, I'll let you take a share of the action. I never could bear to see a pretty girl cry. He's got quite a mouth. Rosa, give him a hand. With what? Sub sub. Cura. Thanks. Not one, but two charming ladies. Maybe this won't be so bad after all. Alright, let's do this. Gee, I don't know about him. Ninja Edge has joined the party. Of course he has. Why wouldn't you? Okay, let's uh, equip him with some good shit. Oh, no. Hold on. There he is. And it turns out you can't equip him with anything, and uh, I bought some items for no fucking reason. Jolly good. Well, hopefully he's strong. What level's he on? Is he at some shit level? Yeah, he is. He's level 25. Thankfully, I think he's only a temporary uh, temporary addition to the party. Uh, right. That should, should be all of the items. 20 out of 20. He's always edging himself. Ooh, careful you. <laughs> hey. Um, okay. What we got here? Ah, Tower of Babel again. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm just going to get a notepad out so we can follow along the bestiary because this is probably a once, uh, once only thing. So, balloon, that's going to be a type of bomb. Uh, sorcerer. Ghost Knight. Lamia Matriarch. Grudger. Green Dragon. Wonderful, we're going to start meeting dragons at this point in the game. And a Mithril Golem. If you have a Twitch people for Adventure Party, who are you going to take with you? You can choose four people with you. Um, well, you've asked a question now, so I'd have to take you. Uh, I'd take you, Muthy. I'd take Chicken McBooks, and um, I'd need some comic relief, so I, I don't know. I think I might might take uh, might take uh, oh god you're asking now you are asking now I mean you can meet party members a bit later on if it's Final Fantasy I think I'd take I think I'd take Cram for the comic relief Cram Snevis right okay. How do we get in? Hehe, <laughs> what's this? Ready? Oh. Bloody hell, I don't know what class I'd be. Um, I don't know. I, I'd be a level, level 7 dickhead. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'd be. <laughs> okay. Uh, what floor are we on? I think we're on the B1. Okay, good. So this is a one-visit dungeon, so I am going to have a guide up for this uh, this part. I have the healer vibe. In fact, uh, we're two hours into the stream, so I'm just going to have a quick cigarette before we continue. So I'll be right back. Thank you for sticking with me. Um, I'll be on for a couple more hours. That guy was about to drive into my pathway and then back out of my pathway again. Unbelievable, man. What are you do? You dumb fuck! Well done for your idea, Daniel. You smelly little shit cunt. You actually had a brilliant idea. Just a shame it's fully going to get used against you. If I put this in capitals, will the computer shout IT? Not quite sure about that. I guess I'll have to send this message just to test it. Daniel is from Spain. Wigan is a shithole. Anyone that is from Wigan is an ONS. 
Daniel's parents are twins blah blah all I know is that I've given Harris 75 pence for these hilarious messages. I think their aim is actually a lot better on uh, on this mode. Oh, that's an unfortunate place to spawn for you. Oh, he's gone for it again. We've seen this win matches for Rollins. It's just a spot fest, and they're all spots at my expense. It's a bigger spot fest than the elephant man's ball sack. Jill, here's a lock pick. It might be handy if you, the master of unlocking, God, the master of unlocking. I forgot about that. Thanks. Maybe I'll need it. And he's off. Wow. <laughs> Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Oh, God! Oh. <laughs> Dark Knight, too slow! Too slow, too slow, too slow. Too slow. Close to the floor. Look at it. Lost control. Lost control. I'm up. I'm up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, there's a battery. Fuck! No! Get the battery! Pick it up! Fuck off! Pick up the battery! I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Leave me alone. Ask why. Ask why. Come on, man. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Gonna Come get on. eaten out. Scoot. Ain't gonna wait forever. Oh, it's that bit there that gets me. To, well, it's every bit, everywhere that gets me. This is the hardest bit of any game that I have ever played. How does that even? If you're ever in the mood for another workout... Yeah, I just want to do go straight for you, mate. You want to go, do ya? All right, then! Not particularly anymore. I just remembered how annoying this was from the PS4 version, but even then you I don't think I had this trouble. Scared. <laughs> you scared. Hey, look at Chuck Liddell over here. Oi, Chuck. <laughs> he, he totally nad-punched him as well. He got him in the sack. 
He sat tucked in and then pulled him into Okay, I'm back. Right. Let's go. Okay, there's Ghost Knight and Sorcerer straight off the bat. Excellent. Right then. Let's open that chest. Oh, another mystery egg. Brilliant. one of these things again. No, we didn't no sweat then. Okay, we've got the silver hour, hourglass. Let's go, 2F. Or B2. Oh, so we're going down. I thought we would have gone up. Sorry. yet? I think we have. Pyjamas. I am indeed wearing Avengers pyjamas. And a clutch t-shirt. Oh great, okay. How much HP have these guys got? Oh my god! God damn it. I got the itch in this heel spell. Sorry, Miss Harris, for your struggle. It's okay, I'm sure I'll be alright. Brilliant. Level up, level up, level up. I better heal him there. Although, Ogre Killer. Right, okay, let's see what that does. Yes, then. I'll get there one day at a time. 
Strawberry Coke, join the party. And who doesn't like a strawberry coke now and again? Ah, balloons. Brilliant. I'm not too keen on strawberry, but I'm all about flavoured cokes. I do like a cherry coke. Which is what I've had the last couple of nights. I do like a cherry coke. In Turkey, we don't have cola flavours. Oh! There are some good ones out there. Um, hopefully you get to try them soon. Uh, vanilla Coke is very good. Um, and uh, we do find American import Cokes over here, or Dr. Peppers. One of my favourite Dr. Peppers is uh, vanilla and uh, vanilla and cream soda flavour Dr. Pepper, and that's pretty good. Or cherry Dr. Pepper, that's good as well. I'm sensing a theme here, but oddly enough, I'm not too keen on cherries. Right, okay, so... Where am I wanting to go here? Let's see. East. Someone gave me a Coke Zero um, one time and hopes I didn't notice. Just let me drink sewer water and said, please. My all-time favourite is Dr. Pepper Cherry, but my stomach disagrees terrible nowadays. Coke Zero feels like with more sugar. I'm guessing it's different in different countries and stuff. Okay, so we got a Lillis kiss in here. Didn't they do Coke Vanilla too? Yeah, Vanilla Coke, yeah. Vanilla Coke's brilliant, especially with rum. Lovely. Okay. I haven't seen a grudge just yet. Green Dragon. Holy hell. Is this thing going to beat the living piss out of me or what? That's another one off the best you're in there. An edge learned pin. I love that word. Lovely. Lovely stuff. Tongue, for example. Who eats tongue, for goodness sake? Imagine a tongue sticking out of a sesame seed cob. Okay, so we got an Ashura. What is an Ashura? What is that? It, that sounds like the kind of thing that uh, this dude. Yo, what a great ass! Oh, here we go. <laughs> Second that. time tonight. <laughs> big meaty men slapping me. You want to see two big men with big <laughs> with big chests? <laughs> And big muscles. <laughs> Bumming meat. <laughs> okay, so we're now back on B3. That's why I'm here. That's why I was stressing as a kid. You want your five star matches? You want your 30 minute classics? <laughs> ah, there's a good gym as well. Brilliant. <laughs> big meaty man slapping me. <laughs> <laughs> Rip it up. <laughs> she 
use a cottage here and get saved. Uh, I am quite enjoying this um, Spanish beer, I think it is. Um, beer Moretti, it seems to be quite popular over here, isn't it? I'm enjoying it very much. Okay, Terra Bay will be free. Now we enter the second door. Yes, hydrate. Then the obvious door there. Now we need to take the left bridge. Oh god, really is confused. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit, that's not good. That's not good at all. Oh god, and my healer. Brilliant. I'm kill that Lamia quite quick. Oh no. Okay, we're alright. What? 82,000 gil? That'll do. That green dragon is a uh, really rare encounter, so I'm quite surprised at you seeing it um, so often. I think that's that's a third one. I'm not complaining, it just means we're not running around trying to fill the best you're in. Oh, the king and queen of Ablan. Edge, father, mother. Thank heavens you're alright. You're alive? Come with us, Edge. Yes, come with us. Where will we go? To hell! What? Fools, burn to ashes. What's going on? Father, mother. To hell. It's me, Edge, your son. The king and queen break free from the spell. Edge. Why do they look like monsters? We are no longer human. Well, I guess so. that's why I'm beating the living piss out of you. We no longer belong here. Okay, we'll die then. I'm sorry, Edge. We must go now. Eblin lies in good hands. Better give one to the Queen just for uh, the hell of it. Don't leave me! Farewell, my son. Mother, don't go! Bro beating his parents. Edge. Oh, here we go.
Okay, right. Rubicante, you twisted devil. I'm sorry for your loss, but it was Lugia who paired you, uh, turned your parents into monsters. My only wish is to battle you fairly. To hell with yourself, righteous blabbering. I admire your spirit. But anger can never draw out one's true strength. It binds you to what you truly need to see. Shut up, I'll show you the power of rage. Alright, let's go then. Anger evokes Ray Edge's dormant powers. He has learned Flood and Blitz. Well, this is interesting. Still, nothing can penetrate my cloak of flame. Nothing, not even ice. Well, we'll see about that. Mm. I shall restore you to full strength. You tell me after you've used my bloody potions. Right, so the key to this fight is not to attack when his cape is up. So now I can attack. Shit. Go, 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 summon Shiva, Shiva, before he gets stressed again. Oh no, come on! Ready, are you gonna summon or what? Are you gonna summon? Summon now! Perfect. Sag more like. <laughs>
going hit, 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 hit. Shit, that's my healer down. That's my healer down. I need to heal her. Fuck. He should be halfway down. He got his leg out to show some skin. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely he did. Damn it, man. That inferno is a fucking shitter of an attack. Absolute shit house. not good. That's going to heal him as well. Damn it. Okay. This should hit him. Well, Faro doesn't really do that much damage. We should hit Rashiva now. Come on. Okay. 
Okay, that's edge out of the question. God, edge is shocking. Well thought, but this is not the end. I shall rise again. Git. <sighs> Even the weak become strong when they work together. I'm most impressed. Until we meet again. Father, mother, you can rest in peace now. Alright. Brilliant. GG, thank you for the GGs. That was a really annoying fight. I guess there was no point in uh, waiting for the Shiva. Oh, what we got going on here? Gramps, pray, let us fight with you. Where is that devil Rubicante? We got him, it's over. Splendid, these people helped me out. Oh my, it's you. So who's this Golbez? Rubicante's master. He plans to gather the crystals so he can reach the moon. Why the moon? We don't know exactly. We think he seeks out some great power that's hidden there. We have to stop him. So he's the evil mastermind behind all this? Going with you. But your highness, Evelyn needs you. Evelyn can wait. We've got to stop this guy before it's too late. But... Uh, stop worrying and go home. It'll be fine. Very well. Everyone, please take good care of our prince. May fortune favour you, your highness. Thank you, everyone. Okay, let's go get Galvez. We need the crystals first. Right, right, lead the way. It's a trap. Oh. All right. Then. Ow, that hurt. That was a nasty drop. Okay. So we should get those missing uh, missing enemies now. So the ones which I am missing are the Lemire Matriarch and the Mithril Golem. And cheers for the GG's, my thing. Um, guys, if you're not already, please do give uh, the wonderful Mr. Mad Muthy a follow. We do like Mr. Mad Muthy here. Uh, right, okay. Now there's only one more chest. Ah, there's the Lemire Matriarch. Now it's just the Mithril Golem. Cheers for the SO. I'll get a clip in the next 84 years, honest. <laughs> Right, I need a Mithril Golem, so I'm just going to fight around here until one turns up. Leveling.
Oh, 8F or later, we might still be alright. Just realised Rose is still out of uh, EP um, MP, in, so I might need to just give her a couple of EPs. That'll last. Riddy's dead shit. I should probably heal her. God damn it. That's the way out that we need, but I need to fight a mithril golem because I don't know if we'll find it again. Oh, fuck off, man. Let's just kill Riddier again. No. I don't know. Easy target, I guess.
Stop using Phoenix Downs. They've done it again. goodness sake. Probably take out the matriarch. Just, just saying. It might be a good idea to take out the matriarch first. Is there anywhere else we can find this mithril golem? Mithril and Golems are on B1. Okay. But B1 is ages ago. Just give me a second. I'm so sorry about this. Right, so it might just be a reset. So let's... Because this has worked a few times for us now. I'm going to quick save it. And I'm going to return to the title screen. Right, then I'm going to have a look through the bestiary. So we're looking for the Mithril, Mithril Gold. No. And I bet it fits right there. Okay. This really isn't working. Apparently they're on B1, so I'm just going to 
I don't know what I'm gonna do. Can even go back to P1 here. Yeah, I think that's the case. Right, I can't go back to B1. So I've just got to hope it's uh, around here. I'm going to keep going to the airship. And Curl and Sorcerer. So the Sorcerer wasn't spawning much from what I remember. Oh, fuck off. Oh, that's annoying. Wasting on the Phoenix Downs at this rate. like the egg earlier on but it's uh oh god not again no don't cast phoenix down you fucking idiot okay now I'll probably cast phoenix down Perfect. Or not perfect, because Cecil's dead. Right. For fuck off. Now I can get out of this hole. I like more. Oh, now we've got two of them. I told you, didn't I? I told you we get two. Now he's dead again. enemy airship. Let's use it to get out of here. But that's stealing. Who cares? Besides, we'll put it to better use. Could be another trap. 
Hey, she's not bad. Let's call her Falcon. What do you think, Lydia? What does it matter? Let's get going. Yes, let's go. Falcon, take us up. Okay, now we can fly through the air on the underworld. Okay, let's go to the Dwarven Castle. Oh, I can't go over lava though. Okay, well that's pretty fucking useless to me. cottage here. I'm going to save and then I'm going to play for probably about an hour more before I go to bed. So, let's get saved. My god. BRB guys. I to understand why. I discovered something most fascinating. Our DNA Is that Robin Cook? It contains not only genetic instructions passed down from previous well, generations, David Blunkett, one of the but two. memories as well. The memories of our ancestors. Hey. And the <laughs> Animus lets you hey, decode and read these DNA <laughs> files. Hey, Sammy. Nell said you needed to see us. Mark Hawk is hard. Reminds me of Evelyn from Resident Evil 7. <laughs> oh my fucking god! This time there's going to be no floors and I'm going to get where I need to be. This isn't even a hard bit. I mean, if I'm having trouble here, then god knows how it's going to be towards the end of the game. Oh my days. What the hell do I do here? Yeah. Shit, 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 shit. Ah, oh, there's a battery. Fuck! No! Get the battery! Pick it up! Fuck off! Pick up the battery! No, shoot the guy who's shooting you, you fucking idiot! They're still shooting you! Gonna take a two-minute break. Ah! Run him! Jesus! Oh! Fuck! Fuck! Sorry, babe. <laughs> I'm not going to use it for anything creepy. I'm just going to use it in my group of friends. We normally share a picture of girls. Don't worry, it's not what you think. They're all naked and getting... You know. They might not appreciate yours truly because you're not going to be, you know, getting... But still, maybe me and my group of friends could come by your house King Seven, it's just all in fest. All in. Go all in. Come on, let's see you. There's my king. Ah, 
you fucking wanker. Okay, I'm going to win my money back. Because that's how gambling works. You keep going until you win your money back. Okay, now I'm in debt by a million. Fifteen. Stand. House wins. That coke was I'm sorry, sir. You don't have the funds. You think I'm going to fail first clown? What you Dicks. I can't wait for what sound the bin makes. <laughs> Especially if that's your kind of thing, dating dads. Who knows? It's it's not for me, but uh, I'm gonna. Um, I'm going to throw my all into it. You know, I, I want to get this full, full experience. Let's, uh, let's say, uh, I want to, I want to make the best of a, make the best of a dad situation. Huh? Huh? Still a bit wheezy, but loads better. I like this game better with the babies. Entering zero gravity. Well, that's one win down. Go team. Hmm. What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah, wouldn't bet on Hi, I'm Troy McClure. You may remember me from such films as Alice Doesn't Live Anymore. Or Mommy, What's Wrong With That Man's Face? I guess what? <laughs> <laughs> Keep your hands off my mop. <laughs> Yar. <laughs> you didn't okay, I have returned. Right then. To the Dwarven Castle then. You've returned. I have. Were you able to recover the crystals? No, I'm sorry. I see. Golbez is very persistent. He's trying to open the sealed cavern by force. It will only be a matter of time before he succeeds. I want you to get the crystal before he does. Luca, come here. Yes, your necklace. Here. This is the key to open the sealed cavern. With the necklace, the entrance will allow you to pass. We must protect the last crystal. We'll do our best. Okay, so I've got Lucas's. Uh, yeah. Have I got all the items here? I think I did. Okay. We hold off the enemy, you head to the sealed cabinet. Okay, boss. Um,
No, oh, Sid. Hey, where's my food? Sid. There's more false deaths in this game than you can shake a stick at. I can't believe it. How did you... Hehe. <laughs> who's this geezer? Geezer? Who's this snot-nosed kid? Watch your mouth, windbag. You got a name to go with that yappy oars run? You're speaking to Edge, Prince of Ablan. It's hard to believe, but it's true. I'm also handsome and really skilled. Stop that. He's in no condition to be antagonised by you. Hehe. <laughs> really has got you whipped, eh, kid? Shut up. Jeez. So what of Golbez? He still holds all the crystals except one. But we can't go after the last crystal since we left the Enterprise at the surface. We've taken an enemy airship, but it can't fly over the magma. I guess it's time for me to shine again. What'd you do without me, eh? Back to bed. Wait till you heal. Ah, can it. Give me a hand. I think he's fine. Yeah. So he seems very resilient to explosions and falling into lava, apparently so. Now you can fly over anything. Thank you. Sid? S oh, he's just sleeping. He must be pooped. He's ever worked himself again. Thanks, Sid. left us on the airship, but never mind. Okay. Blood flower, eh? Okay, Tumtra, so we can buy some really cool shit here, um, if I remember correctly, in terms of weapons and stuff, which would just make us next level. Okay, so, what have you got? What can I do for you? Give me another one of them. Uh, then one of them. Got one of them. Got one of them. Got one of them. No, mate, I want to get in there. Okay.
There we go. Right. I should probably sell a bunch of my shit. I'll keep those just in case. There we go. So that's for spending a bunch of cash. Now where's the item shop? We'll go there next. Western house we need to go to now. Huh? Which is up here. Well, I mean, I'd already sort of started taking it, so. Sos boss. Right, okay. That should be everything in this city. So we're going to go to the northwest corner, which has got a small island. This is the Cave of Summons, so this is a slight detour where we've got a load of stuff in the bestiary which we need to get, so again, out comes my notepad, and Hell Flapper, Belfagor, Bloody Eye, this sounds delightful, Warrior, Mini Satana Summoner Arachne Thunder Dragon and King Naga. These enemies seem like they're going to be bastards. So let's uh, let's see how we do. Okay, mini Satana and Warrior straight off the bat. Lovely. Oh, Jesus Christmas!
Yeah, I think we might be under leveled for here, man. Fuck. I'm so underleveled for this fucking dungeon, man. Honestly. That's not good. No, don't attack yourself, you dick. Well, that seemed fairly efficient. Okay, right. High potion. Lovely.
Attack the enemy! I'm quite clearly selecting attack enemy. I'm trying to get him to spawn the Thunder Dragon. Right, this again. Oh, for fuck's sake. Legit thought you were inside a beef. Beast how it looks. Not like a cave. Edge is shit because it's so low level. You know, if you really want to. You can fucking cast fucking Titan Summon, not kill Edge all the time because he's so shit. I ate these. I don't like that boss fight. It's not a boss fight, it's a regular encounter. I just think I'm in here way too early.
Oh, hell factor. Okay, that's different. And that's one of the things I need. It looks like he's just going to keep summoning the same thing. Four twenty. Summon something or what? Oh, another one. Okay, high potion. Excellent. Edge needs to up a level soon, seriously. He just takes too much damage and then flaps it. Okay, there's a cottage. Brilliant. Ah, Belfagor. Hello. Okay, Phoenix down. Two belt fills. I prefer Yang. Edge's a temp player. I can't remember how long he stays with the party. Okay, there's a Thunder Dragon. Cecil. Perfect. Gotta just make sure I'm healed after that because uh, that Thunderbolt is a bit unforgiving. Um, I can't remember how long Edge stays with the party or if he's in right at the very end. I really can't. Um, 
as I say, it's been about like sort of three years since I played this. Maybe longer. Ah, Arachnids. Oh, they use Earthquake. Brilliant, because I'm floating. Looks like the kind of thing you'd equip. Sure is. Well, hopefully it strengthens him a bit. Okay. So it's just a bloody eye that we need now. A bloody eye, not both. Both of you. Okay, he's hitting for some good hit points now. So I guess that's the advantage. This has got Thunder Dragon all over it. Okay, this is going to be a tough fight. I already know what I'm fighting, because uh, I've seen it in the guide. And this is not going to be a comforting fight. It's not going to be nice at all. Let me get my instructions in for auto battle, please. Okay, I'm going to need a lot of cure out here. Summon type is probably sensible. Five of these dudes, yeah. And they're all super fast. Okay, one down, good. Two cottages. Okay. And then a defender, which is an amazing weapon for Cecil, apparently. So this is one of the stronger swords in the game. 127 power. Now, if you put that next to what Kane's wielding at the minute, it's 108. It means we'll be able to chop the shit out of things. Right, so... Okay, now we're in the land of summons, which is uh, which is great. Really, you've returned.
Ridia was the first human to ever come here. Okay. There's a rat tail. King of Summons resides below. And I seem to remember that's a shitter of a fight as well. Okay, cool. So we are in a secret room. Okay, everyone is fucked. Attack night you want straight away from my mage. Brilliant. to go back to the warp pad. The rat tail is uh, an item from Final Fantasy 1. I'm, I think it's used at the smithy and it gives us, um, or is at least part of Excalibur, but I may be wrong. They say you can't meet the king without defeating Queen Azura first. This is a library. Yeah, okay, cool. It's also on Final Fantasy IX in the auction. It is indeed, yes, you're right. Edge flipping us off when selecting her uh, equip. Yeah, definitely. Okay. God, this music is very repetitive, though, to be fair. Welcome, what can I do for you? of bloodlands because it keeps me healed. Okay.
<laughs> mm, yeah, actually, that makes sense. It's really funny because if you watch the first Final Fantasy with the old pixels, or at least the PS1 version, it looks like they're going when they're about to cast magic. Wait, where was the item shop? Because it says it's in that bloody building. Teams of mages taught them in a beneficial way to them, so we best you eat. Phoenix down. Right, okay. Should be two hidden items. I don't know where they are. I haven't come across any pots or anything just yet. Okay, we want to go to the library, which is this building here. Okay, there's two battles here for summons. Queen Azura, pretty dear, what brings you back to us? We need your help. Very well, but first you must prove your worst. That is the way of things here. I'm gonna get battered.
Edge, you're just shit, mate. You are proper shit. Come on. Yes, get it. Oh my god, cheers to the GG, really really learned far ago. You've proven your worth, you may summon me whenever you desire. Didn't get any guilt for it though, did I? 
Okay. I am kind of having fun, so after this I think I'll have a cigarette and then I'll uh, continue. Um, but till three at the very latest I think I'll go. Okay, so this is going to be uh, a rough fight. I think it should be alright, it's just edge is too low leveled. just about be able to worry about all through this one. Got some beer to go the last hour. Of course I do. Of course I have. All I have to do is keep an eye on their um, MP. Should be okay. Thing is, he's got around about. 50,000 HP, so be a few turns. Don't give yourself dry if you prick. Well, maybe do. facing the wrong way, is it confused? 
Not anymore, man. There we go. Fan Fantastic. Indeed, your spirit is righteous. I, Leviathan, King of Summons, shall serve you. Right, amazing. Cool. That is good. That is a good thing. Right, I should be right back. I'm going to go for a final cigarette, and then we'll play out until, uh, well, around about 3 o'clock. Okay, BRB, guys. He went down much faster than Azura. Well, Azura noticeably had uh, counter-attacks, and... Uh, yeah, it was rough. I regret using so many dry ethers, but, you know, it happens. Hopefully we got enough to heal ourselves so we can make our way back through the cave um, and uh, get the um, bloody eye. Right, I'll be, I'll be. Fucking hell, this is like when the kids run around in Brewer's Fair. Sit down, you little gimp, or you're not getting a toffee pudding. <laughs> Made it past the BBFC. Then make your way to the room in the back. Or Peggy. And wait. Cloud? You don't see anything, mine. <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. No thanks. Check. Get that loose head. That's more like. Mm. Seven two off. That's an all in hand if I ever saw it. That hit was for sixty nine. This one's to Chris, who is getting married on Saturday. I'm DJing his wedding. I'm missing Halloween at the Campbell just for him because he's a good guy. Uh. Well done, my little sociopath. <laughs> I like to smash. Now there is no chance Oop, my Truchosaurus will go on a killing rampage with the screaming and the sadness. Apparently it is. <laughs> ah! Oh my god. Something here. Settle down. Oh. Ah. Oh, I'd like to kiss her. I might try that again. Ha 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 ha! Oh, that was speedrun class! I heard you're a fan of Cena. I don't mind Cena, I think he's alright. Cena these nuts, you're a fucking dick. Garage attached to a chain link fence. Okay, there it is. Ba, ba, ba. 
Okay, right. Where to next? We need the blood eye. So let's make our way back. God, this music's insufferable. Hmm. I haven't got enough gill. Is it gill or jill? I've always said gill. Ah, oh, brilliant. Oh god, they hit for some fucking points, though. God, that's been put to rest. I've heard that everyone's, uh, everyone who speaks Gaelic is really annoyed that Kate Sith is now Kate Sith and not uh, Ket She. Yeah, there's people calling Tedus because it was Tedus in uh, Kingdom Hearts or whatever. But it makes sense because uh, because he plays Blitzball and there's tides around Zanakin. Yeah. I mean, I prefer Tidus. I think Tidus sounds a lot better. It's a, it's a proper room. It's what I would think it sounds like. Let's just call him Tidders. Tidders the football player. I mean, Tidders. It sounds like he plays golf. Like teeing off. One thing I will say for Final Fantasy IV is it's got a hell of a fucking difficulty spike in certain places. Tiddles. Tiddles the ball sack. Good enough. Maybe titters is a word for laughter. And because he goes ha 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 ha, he should be called titters. Just call him Tit. Or Twat. Okay, brilliant. That is cringe on a whole other level. Did you see where they've done the entire soundtrack in his laugh? It's one of the best videos on YouTube.
this is uh, this is brilliant. I mean, as soon as it gets there. I'll just mute this while we do it. Oh, I wonder if they do fight with Seymour. Oh, this would be amazing. This is going to be incredible. This is the best track in Final Fantasy X. I can't wait to see what they've done with it. I'd never actually sat through the three and a half hours. I don't know how anyone could. <laughs> oh dear me. Amazing. Have you seen a, a new word? The MIDI instruments. Yeah, it's fucking great. Okay, anyway, what were we doing? That's right, Final Fantasy IV. Okay, the Sylvan Cave. Right. Oh, bloody brilliant. I've just had a look and seen um, what we're looking to face. So, underground, tiny toad, bog witch, evil dreamer, Mammon and the wonderful Marlboro. <sighs> Everyone's favourite. Although I did see these Marlboro slippers that I really wanted on uh, Square Enix's site, but I don't think they do them anymore. Okay, so.
brilliant. Let's uh, let's let's get a cottage done and then let's try that again. This is what I mean about the difficulty spike. I mean, it's it's uh, ludicrous. Okay, right. Just notice who's dead again. Is there any point in you at all? I mean, honestly. She's got silence on her as well. For fuck's sake.
Okay. Okay. Bollocks. Get ready to turn everyone into toads again. Oh, this is the most frustrating area of the fucking game. XP for the trouble though. Please tell me I got the other two chests then before I drop down. I'll have to remember that if I'm too short.
so frustrating, man. I hate them so much. Okay, this is going to be fun. Stop going for edge. So shit.
I've yet to see the benefit of uh, Edge in the party. Really hurt. Okay. Underground are these the last ones I need. Oh, okay. Well, that was fair enough. Sound. Oh, for goodness sake. I'll be alright as long as they don't get rid of it. Come on. Oh no. No. Oh, are you? Don't use it on yourself, you burk! Oh no! Oh, how are you still a pig? Oh, it's over. It's over. It's done.
that one in the middle, isn't it? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get it in there. Get it in there before the bad breath comes in. Get it in. Don't hit Rydia. Don't hit Rydia. Don't hit Rydia. Don't hit Rydia. Oh, I hit Rydia. It's over. she attacking? That's not what I said for her to do automatically. Okay, alright. Okay, alright, I think we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Take them all out.
I might leave it. Of course, this is an optional area, so it might be that the difficulty spike isn't too bad and I'm just doing things that I shouldn't really be doing at this stage. But oh well, I'm still alive. Okay, that's my sanity check done. There's nothing, uh, I've made sure that I've done that. Right, okay, so. Oh boy. Is that even better? Or is that not as good? I wonder. It's not as good. Oh god. Okay. Sooner that than bloody Marlboros. Okay.
Oh, Spaceman. I'm just about to wrap up pretty shortly, but thank you for raiding. How was your stream? Was it okay? I hope you are well. Oh, and Sourced as well. I can't believe you put Gollum on my wheel. Yeah, I've heard that you've got to play it now. Have fun with that. I sure didn't. <laughs> when are you starting it? I'm going to suck out your venom. No one look. This is a medical procedure. No, this is a medical procedure. Don't, no, don't. It's not what it looks like. It's not what it looks like. No, that was blood I spat out. From his leg, okay? One, a, a real leg, not a third leg. I owe you. Oh, man. Ooh, I'm so really excited. Tough, you know what, I'll pump him up. Unsourced, Bev. Hello. Never mind. Good to see you. Oh, yeah, I'll pump him up. There you go, buddy. Did someone clip the oh, moment that it this. landed on the uh, on. on the circle? Because I'm going to have to go Easy back and claps. watch that. Ah. <laughs> Let's go. Cadence all sort of ashes. Don't even want them. Don't care. Nothing will beat the ashes. I think I, have. I swear my vengeance He's upon two you. Bosses by oh, I'm really, really Goodbye. looking forward Good to work. it. I'm gonna have a look at that straight after this. When she shanks you, you get a little. Uh... I'm not sure what was said there. I am playing Final Fantasy IV this evening. Oh, brilliant. Excellent. Sorry. I, I can't wait to live this moment for the first time. Just give me one second. Let's uh, let's see what this looks like. Um, how was your stream other than that? Or are, you, or are you not wanting to talk to me? Okay, let's see. As interact, except cookies. Hang on. Come on. I really can't wait. I actually can't wait. I regret nothing. Okay. At least it made for a good clip. And we will spin. The big wheel. No! The big wheel. I can to see that again. No! The big wheel. Actually, I've got to watch it a third time. This is amazing. No! <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, that's amazing. That perfectly cut scream. That's killed me. <laughs> oh man, it's such a broken game. You're gonna have so much fun with it. Oh. oh, at least I do not suffer alone. Oh, that's incredible. Oh, wait until I tell European Post Office and Kim Garden Cop. They're going to want to tune in for those. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, shit, I didn't heal. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh man. Fuck no, it's 3 a.m. I've got work in the morning. This was a bad idea. Oh, that's brilliant. I can't wait to watch the actual thing. <laughs> man, to be fair, I. 
at least initially, it was really funny because of how broken it was, and then you realise, oh, I'm sort of committed, and now I've got to finish this. Whereas, I suppose you can turn it off as soon as you as soon as you wish, within reason. But um, I will be tuning in. I will be tuning in to support, as I have inflicted the misery on you. I'm 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 very happy to uh, very happy to support it, or at least watch you suffer as I have once suffered. Oh, guys, I hope everyone's well. Um, and uh, if uh, if you have just been hanging around before that raid, please do check out like the Unsourced Transitive Verb and the Spaceman. Great streamers. And uh, and yeah, yeah. I, I can't believe that. That clip is perfect. That clip has made made my day. Or made my evening. Some say I'm a sadist. I only said it for a joke as well. Like I, I didn't think it was actually going to land on you. Of all of the things it could have landed on. Hmm. I'll think about checking out these streamers. Hopefully it's not just like us four in here who follow each other anyway. Verb, did you do any more of those... Uh, Chat GPT stories. Have you learned how to travel exclusively via hot air balloon? Yes, the spaceman, the spaceman jeep. I think it's actually pronounced Spacky Man. The spaceman. Yes, that's right. The sparse man. It's it. It's a bit like cement. Oh, the spaceman G. Got it. Yeah, because it's because it's like O M G. You can just call me Smeagol. Oh, so you're going for a good playthrough then? <laughs> oh, I want to say I'm sorry, but I'd be lying. And we don't lie here. Oh, for fucking hell. What's on the streamer, Prussels? Mange. Okay, I don't want to accidentally check out the wrong person. <laughs> But the voice acting in that game as well is absolutely awful. It is fucking horrendous. You're gonna have a great time. Okay, now where do we go? What's that? Is that UN Sour? UN Sour CED? Or UN Sour said? How goes the uh, Bloodborne? Un Sour said. Okay, cool. Is that said or, or Ked? I, I don't. I don't know. And I did make more stories. We did ride in hot air balloons and we did get to chat GPT to give handles platonically. And we moved on to the storyboarding. Sto storyboarding? Oh, oh, oh yes. Oh yes, I'm looking forward to this. When are you next? Uh, when are you advancing on this? I, I really need to be. I really need to be present. I want to see this little baby in action. Nailed it. Bloodborne sucks. <laughs> okay. I'm 
going to start start the frames for animation. I'm so excited. I regret everything. Have you given up on it? Or are you now done? I know that you were stuck on like those two bosses for quite a while. If they are bosses. I hope they're bosses. Right, okay. I'm so excited to see how that animation turns out. I really am. No word of a lie. I'm very, very excited. Not yet. Two bosses left, but one of them is a big old bitch. Are they the same ones that I've seen you on for quite a while? You got the one dude who's just on fire with their breakable hands. And then some Grim Reaper looking dude. I don't know. I've not played Bloodborne yet. I do intend to soon. Fire guy. Yeah, he's lame. Although I have spent a bit on blurps and enjoyed myself a lot whilst watching you fight said fire guy. I've enjoyed it. And I think the thing I've most enjoyed is watching you so beautifully sing The Reason by seminal um, pop rock artists Huberstank. Okay, this has got to be it, surely. Like, I mean, is there... Am, am I good here? Is this... Oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Preemptive strike. Okay, jump. It didn't give me time! I don't think you understand the meaning of preemptive strike if you just go first, you dickhead. The bulk of animating is going to happen off stream simply because there's so much of it, but I will show all the progress. I really cannot wait to see it. I had a lot of fun just watching ChatGPT do, Chat do its thing. If, if it sounds like I'm struggling with words, it is because it is the very early time of 3.10. I'm not going to be on for too long because I do have work tomorrow. Okay, so what have we got here? So that's all 30. Yikes, humans. Go away. Alright, sorry. We won't hand Yang over. We found him lying near the mouth of the cave. He told us his name and then he passed out. We've been taking care of him since, but he's yet to reawaken. Oh, okay. Sorry, Yang. Um. So where am I here? Sylvan Cottage. Okay, there's apparently a hidden item. Where is it though? I don't think I don't think I'm, I might be allowed to claim it just yet. Lame. Are there any secret passages around here? Chat GPT is wild. I love it. I found a reason to. Okay, I'm going to wrap it here. Um. Thank you very much for the raid, Space Bang. Uh, I apologise for your pain again, and it's so good to see everyone. Um, I've had a had a jolly good evening with a raid of 15. Uh, two raids today. Raid of 15, raid of 7, a couple of resubs. It's been alright, and I appreciate everyone who's stopped by to watch. Now let's see who is currently on on the Tinterwebs playing, playing on... Ooh, Cram Snavitz is on. And the reason is you. I should have probably started this raid before uh, before we started. Um, I'm not going to give you a raid script. Just just tell him tell him that you're fucking raiding. You've all seen cram stuff before. 
But thank you for stopping by. Always a pleasure. Never a chore. And I'll be back tomorrow with some Dragon Age Inquisition. Big love, guys. I'm going to raid and run from Cram as well because I'm fucking tired. See you soon.